It's been a long day for Bay County. After a week of debate over whether or not to close area beaches, elected officials came together and made a decision, all in an effort to keep COVID-19 from spreading here. As News 13's Emma Stamps tells us, the beaches are now officially closed in Bay County. Both the Panama City Beach City Council and Bay County Commissioners calling emergency meetings on Friday. This COVID state of emergency will probably stay in place as long as the state has their state of emergency. However, the beach closure we will readdress every seven days. The county met late Friday afternoon following an early afternoon meeting by the Beach City Council. One of the most painful decisions I've come to and I, I, I just think that, that you got to put health over the economics in this situation when it, it affects people's uh, health. Panama City Beach voted to close its nine miles of beaches and the county closed the rest, working in unison to get the job done. Starting at 7 p.m., every public beach access point is closed. Beachgoers reacted to the decision. We didn't like the beaches being closed down today, but you know, it's um, I think it's important to take this step because I know there are a lot of spring breakers who just don't quite get it and they're not practicing, you know, the six feet away that I think we all are supposed to be, um, you know, honoring. So it's probably a good thing. Residents said they understand the closure. If we just keep staying in groups and spreading the virus, then it's going to take longer for us to get through this and um, it's going to cost people more money in the long run and more people going to get sick. So I like the idea of closing the beach so the people can't come and gather at the beach. You have to go to drastic measures, so we really respect that. And so when 7 o'clock rolled around, we're going in, going to do the right thing. One concern officials and residents do have is the effect on the economy, but one business owner said he's hoping the closure will allow the community to recover more quickly. We live on um, vacationers and tourists, but I mean, if we have to put them away for a couple weeks for everybody to, to live, then we'll do it just like everybody else does. Both the Panama City Beach Police Department and the Bay County Sheriff's Office say they're ready to enforce the rules. We've got additional resources out on the beach and we'll be, you know, working to diplomatically tell people the beaches are closed and, and ask them to leave the beach. First thing tomorrow morning, we'll send a large group of people out there. We'll probably have 20 ATVs and trucks out there advising the people. So when they're walking down with their coolers and everything else, we can tell them before they set up for the day. And we'll be down there all day, 24 hours a day, educating the people. And like I said, if they don't take the education, we will have to go to other means because we want to protect our community. Emma Stamps, News 13, Panhandle Strong. Now, on the east side of Bay County, Mexico Beach City officials tell us they will not be closing their beaches to the public because they have no hotels for any tourists and are still in Hurricane Michael recovery mode.